Get out I'm, that neon. I've been told we have a pool for a little like two years. Where is it? Or nah. Now, Roy Williams has taken his teams, both Kansas and North Carolina, to seven Final Fours in five title games. Of those five title games, his teams have won two national championships. Oh, by the way, that didn't happen. Well, he's got what? Both of them at Carolina. Yes. Right? Not Kansas, Kansas. Post, but no cigars. Legit or not? Roy and the experience that Williams brings will be the difference in this year's title game against Gonzaga on Monday night. I think so. I think so. These two teams, I think, match up pretty well. They both have bigs. They both have dynamic slashers to the basket. They both have proven guards that you can give the ball and you know they're not going to turn the ball over time and time again. And you have two proven coaches in terms of, you know, in a sterile, in a vacuum. But I think this is where Roy needs to apply his experience. And he does it by reassuring the players. And he does it in certain tactics that I think are little tidbits that can gain an advantage when you're in a larger arena with big swings, extra timeouts, more stoppages. But he just said, I've never won a game from the bench. So I've lost Do you them. believe him? I don't believe any of that. I think he helped win the Kentucky game. Because he said when they were down five and they called a timeout, he didn't like the body language from his kids. So you know what he did? He changed it. Yes. And when you change the body language, that helps win a game onto the court. You take that new swagger yeah. that you didn't have I when you it. sat down, and then you stand up, and all of a sudden we got it because old Huck Finn there. Yeah, you're talking full circle. It's the swag. I think we get that on Monday night. I think he's going to be swagalicious on Monday night.